Serious accusations in a new lawsuit against the city of Twinsburg right now and its police chief. The suit filed by three police officers. 19 investigator Gabby Hart is looking into those allegations and how city leaders are firing back. There are some serious accusations, there allegations are. in here. Yes. Attorney Brian Bardwell is representing three Twinsburg police officers who claim they've been placed on paid administrative leave out of retaliation for trying to shed light on alleged misconduct and corruption within the department. The lawsuit makes mention of several alleged incidents, including, but not limited to, sexual harassment of female officers, botched investigations into those complaints, an alleged cover-up of excessive force used against a suspect, and record tampering. The chief of police apparently cooking the books, um, tampering with government records. The lawsuit also states Twinsburg Police Chief Thomas Mason allegedly intervened to remove his son's name from a report involving underage drinking at a party. Additionally, they allege he worked to keep his daughter's name out of records from a canine operation that targeted drug possession on the campus of Twinsburg High School and that he got his wife out of a speeding ticket. Where's the proof? I mean, the proof is in the records. Attorney Bardwell says they filed this lawsuit because the city has failed to release those public records. They've requested police reports, body cam footage, and correspondence pertaining to these alleged incidents. What we'll do if we need to is through this litigation, we'll call in the officers who were witnesses to all these things. So there's an officer who pulled over the chief's wife and let her go. This lawsuit is just asking release these records or else. Just produce the records. The Twinsburg mayor and safety director released a statement saying in part, I view this recent filing as nothing more than an ill-advised distraction technique and attempt to deflect from the fact that all three officers face potential serious consequences for actions allegedly taken while wearing the uniform. It went on to say, quote, the city unequivocally supports Chief Mason, the Twinsburg police leadership, and the good men and women of the police department against this, quote, despicable smear campaign. They also say Attorney Bardwell and officers have submitted nearly 140 requests and that the city is committed to fulfilling all valid public records requests. Now, I plan to look into every aspect of this lawsuit, every allegation made, and also go and request the video and the police reports that were mentioned here as soon as I learn more. As soon as more develops, I'll keep you posted right here and on Cleveland19.com. For now, I'm in Twinsburg. Gabby Hart, 19 News. According to the city, the officers on leave are accused of violating department policies that are unrelated to the lawsuit.